Welcome back to the Astromech Gaming tutorial series on using Nightbot. In our last episode, we set up Nightbot and got him working. And now let's actually get it set up fully to see what we can do with it. The first thing we're going to do is actually set up a timer, a basic one here. We're just going to click Add in the upper right hand corner. The message is what we're going to call it, and we'll call it just uh, subscribe. And the message will put uh, be sure to subscribe. If we could spell it right. Thanks, smiley face. Right now it's set to go every 15 minutes. We'll drop that up to say every 42 minutes for the heck of it. You can click submit. And then during your live stream, every 42 minutes, that command will pop up. You can also set up other commands such as, you know, leave a like, uh, set different timers, uh, if you have any donation links, that sort of thing. And that'll be it for setting up timers. Also go into options like the spam protection. Uh, we can have blacklist and word, uh, words and phrases turned on and off. Uh, I usually set mine up in YouTube specifically instead of just Nightbot, but you can do it in here also. Excessive caps is on by default, where it will, if people type in all caps, it'll put them in timeout, usually for about five seconds, unless they repeat, repeatedly offend them, might put them out for a few minutes, sometimes I think up to 10. Uh, emotes, the same thing. Links, it'll put them in timeout again, and excessive symbols also. Repetitions, you can also turn on or off. Uh, that way, if they keep putting the same thing over and over again, like, hey, pay attention to me, hey, pay attention to me, you know, that sort of thing, you can enable that so they'll be put in timeout. Again, the timeout is usually for about five seconds and deletes the message and just gives them a warning and tells them why they put them in timeout. And if they continue to do it, it might, I think, goes up to five or ten minutes at that point automatically. The drawback is you really can't undo those timeouts, so hopefully they'll get the hints and uh, listen to the warning. But again, if you're having an issue where if you don't mind caps or don't mind links, you can always turn these options off here. Just uh, click disable on the side here and it'll disable it for you. Uh, so I'll requests and stuff we'll get into later. Uh, but for the most part, uh, commands is going to be your biggest uh, thing you want to do. The default commands are listed here. Um, you can go through them and read through them as you like. Again, you can do commercial ads if you have partners and that sort of thing. You can do polls. You can do regular songs, title, etc. Uh, but custom commands are usually where the more the fun's at. So what you can do is add a command right here. Click add command just like before. The command usually starts with an exclamation point uh, as the default setting for this. You can just put hi and you can put Welcome to the stream. If I could spell again, uh, enjoy your stay or whatever you want to do. Uh, this user level is going to determine who can do it. Uh, everyone is usually set up by default. You can set up supporters, regulators. Moderator is not something you have to set up. Whoever is a moderator in the chat will automatically be able to do this. You don't have to do it separately. That's why I like doing it under moderator for the most part. I generally pick just moderator or everyone. Very few commands I would want the owner, which would be me or you in this case, to be able to do. I'm not sure what command I would not trust my moderators with. But if there is a command that you wouldn't trust them with, like say maybe a contest if you're doing that, you might make it just so you can do it so uh, moderators don't accidentally try to give out a prize that they're not authorized to. Uh, but here the cooldown is going to determine how long you have to wait till doing it again. That way you don't get people spamming it. I usually put it for a minute or two, uh, depending on the command. High is not such a bad one. Usually I might just do a minute or 30 seconds. And then hit submit. And now when you're in chat, if you type hi and hit enter, it should do the command. Sometimes Nightbot is slow to join your channel, and sometimes he does it right away like he did there. Hi, and welcome to the stream. Enjoy your stay. And that's it for basic commands. We're going to cover more advanced commands in the next one, which will use variables, which we can use either the person who put the command in or people that are put in after the fact, and we'll cover all that in the next one. Again, any questions on the basic commands for Nightbot, please do let us know. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next one.